Hello everyone, it's Raquel with The Lady in Her Stamps, and today I am going to make this absolutely beautiful card with you. It's a different take on Valentine's where we're used to seeing kind of reds and pinks and things like that. I really wanted to showcase this absolutely beautiful, beautiful foil um, paper that is in our celebration catalog, which is this little catalog right here that accompanies our mini catalog let me show you really quick this is it's on page 10 and this is let's see and get it up in the camera right this is the set it goes with a stamp set that's in the mini catalog this is the paper and um the paper is absolutely stunning all of it is so pretty there's so many foil um <clears throat> pieces in it let me see if i can pull another one out that is so, so stunning and that is this one that I really really love look at that beautiful but anyway we are going to go ahead and make this really cute little card and I'm gonna set it right here for the moment we'll make our card base and then we'll continue to build on that and we we'll just fold that there use my bone folder we're using a real simple crushed curry to go with this absolutely stunning again it's just beautiful love that color and i thought it was a different color for valentine's day you know because like i said valentine's day we usually use uh certain preset colors and i thought that this would just be super cute to do something a little bit of a different take on it i'm gonna go ahead and cut this off Mm. Scissors, scissors, here we go. Just going to snip that off right there. Okay, so <clears throat> now we have our front part, and this is just laid down flat. This is the opposite side of it, which is, that's the reason why they call it our designer series paper. We've got two different, two different um, designs on them. And I'm gonna lay this right here. This paper, this designer series paper is cut at three and three quarters by five. Three and three quarters by five. <coughs> Excuse me again. I am just gonna lay that on there. This little black piece that I put on here was cut at one inch and you wanna have it at four and a quarter to go all the way across. Okay, so now what we're gonna do move some of these little scrap pieces out of the way now we're going to do some stamping and i'm going to bring in my crushed curry it's my crushed curry and i'm going to use the stamp that's right here that says happy valentine's day pull that out and let's just get a block to put that on right here and then let's ink that up and we want to punch it out so we want to put it somewhere where we can easily punch that out and press down and lift up and close up our ink all right now i'm going to use the two punches that come in the bundle so the bundle is with the stamp set and bundle it comes together the punches Oh, there's so many beautiful things in here. Here is the bundle. It's called the From My Heart. This right here features the punches that I'm using, which come in the bundle for the From My Heart, which is here. And here are the two little punches that go with it. Since I'm using a different stamp set, that's what that is for. So we're gonna use this right here, and we're gonna punch out the heart and we're gonna have a, a nice little border right there around it let's get it as even as possible let's see good enough okay so we'll punch that out and then what we're gonna do is we're gonna use this crushed curry piece of scrap I have and punch out the second heart We'll put this away. 
Then what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and glue this down. This is going down flat right here. That's gonna sit right on that puppy just like that. Then what we're gonna do is we're gonna bring out, these are the hearts that go with that from the heart um, suite. But on the, if you see on the front, so we have flirty flamingo and then we have real red, but on the back they are white. And I'm gonna use the white one from the flirty flamingo. And this is gonna sit right on top of there just like that. So, but first what I'm gonna do is, I also know that I wanna use some, let's see, I think maybe this time I will stick with, hmm. I was gonna go with a different color gold. I mean, not different color gold, but with just something other than gold, but I'm gonna stick with the gold. I'm gonna use some dimensionals and I'm just gonna pop that up, pop this one up. Three should be good. Take the backings off. One, two, three, hurry, hurry. <laughs> and then put this right there on the back, just like that. And then we bring our card back in and I'm just gonna put some right on the back of that, just like that. So it stays down this right in the center, just like that. And then we have our little bow, which is made also from the Honeybee Suite. Let's see. This is the Daffodil Delight um, ribbon. I forget what kind of ribbon it is, because that one doesn't say something rush ribbon. Okay, so we're gonna use that. We're gonna put some glue dots, use some glue dots to put it on there. And really quick, we have that on there. We're gonna pop this down at the bottom, straighten out our little bow. And then we'll just use a couple of these cuties and put them on, let's see, just put them randomly wherever you like. And that is the card for today. How easy was that? Super easy, simple, and you can do the inside however you'd like. But um, I just, like I said, I wanted to show you this beautiful paper and also do a card that's kind of non-traditional, a yellow for um, Valentine's Day is kind of different, but still stinking cute. So thank you guys so much for joining me. I will see you again next time. And um, this is, I know this is in video form and not uh, Stampin' Live. I missed the Stampin' Live. So I'm going to put this in place and then I'll put up a project sheet for it. Okay. So I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.